Well, the downside of a snowstorm, high school basketball gets postponed on Friday night. The good side of a snowstorm means we've got high school basketball on Saturday. Let's start with the top ranked Johnston Girls. They had their hands full early with Dowling Catholic. Lexi Bowles lays it in and then Emma Gipple drives baseline no problem. And then Julia Moore. I don't know how this goes in here, but somehow she gets that up and in. Margaret Tobias also gets through the lane. Dowling having no problem getting to the hoop early, but Johnston wakes up. Jada Jimthy misses, no problem though. Gets the board, goes right back up. And then later in the second quarter, Jimthy pitches it to Isabel Bosley, who gets to the bucket, no problem. Then just before half, Aaliyah Riley on the breakaway. Johnston went on a 15-2 run before half, then just kept it going in the second half. They pull away, end up beating Dowling Catholic. To the guys now, how about this steal and flush? Dowling cutting into Johnston's early nine point lead. They too weren't having trouble getting to the hoop. And we've got ourselves a tight one, but Johnston got rolling. Reed Grant behind the back, not once, but twice. Gets to the hoop up and under, makes it look easy. And then Grant, he can pass it too, up top to Ethan Riemann. Beautiful setup. Johnston ended the first quarter up six, then Grant in the second drive, spins, goes offhand. He had 17 on the day, and then the three started falling for the Dragons. Trey Lewis, wing three, buckets. Dragons pull away. Johnston gets the sweep over Dallin Catholic. To Lincoln High now in Southeast Polk on the road. James Glenn goes baseline, up and in. Rams lead balloon to almost 20 in the second quarter. How about this backdoor pass? Chase Bartlett finds Riley Edwards and the Rams are cruising. Lincoln tried to hang around. Don Capel nails the three, but Southeast Polk just far too much on Saturday. Caleb Daniels down low, skip pass, finds Edwards. It's down, Rams roll over the rails. To the girls' side, this one was 65-13 when I got there. Yeah, that happens. Eva Solseth slashing the lane, lays it up and in, and it's only getting worse for Lincoln. Solseth falling out of bounds, somehow gets it to Grace Larkins. She buries it, and then for good measure, good ball movement. This one was not close. Let's hop on over to Hoover, Marshalltown visiting, and Armani Thomas. My goodness. This one was back and forth early. Elijah Voss spins. Yeah, he matches Thomas, buries it. That's smooth. Coach Henderson looking on, but Bobcats still rolling on offense. Drake Kapayu hits the elbow three. They led after one, but Hoover comes back. They win. Our last stop of the day now, the girls' side, Hoover and Marshalltown. And the Bobcats gelling early. Lily Roberts to Kaitlyn Smith. Fancy pass, and then Roberts gets the rebound and goes right back up with it. For Hoover, though, Maria Turner kept them in it early. But how about Marshalltown? They win a tight one, 42-41. They get their first win of the year.